Well, of course, a lot of shoppers are worried about checking off things on their own checklist, but one college student, she's spending her spring break shopping for seniors in need. It's a scramble at the supermarkets as coronavirus fears feel long lines and empty shelves across the valley. The problem we're facing now is when you go to the store, those items aren't even on the shelves to be able to buy. So I want to move these over here, Jade. Jade Powell isn't picking all of this up for herself. Bottled water, milks, uh, canned goods, soups. The pre-med student at UNR is launching a program called Shopping Angels. It's been, you know, something that I've been really uh, focused on and brainstorming pretty intensely for the last two days. No delivery fees, no extra costs. Powell just wants to help those who can't leave their homes. When you coordinate with us, we'll give you the name of the volunteer who's offering to pick up your stuff and you'll put them on your pickup order so that we can go out and get those groceries to you. Go into one store, could take could be an all day affair for an elderly person. You know, they, they don't have a lot of money to spend on gas and, you know, a lot of energy to drive around to all different stores only to find out that they can't even get the basic supplies that they need to last them for a couple weeks. We've gotten toilet paper, paper towels, cleaning supplies. Anything you might need to get you through a couple of weeks. Powell already has more than three dozen college students in both Reno and Las Vegas ready to help. These boxes we're going to use for storing some of the stuff in so we can organize. Powell says volunteers will be required to wear masks and gloves while picking up groceries. So we're going to have this one. And when they make their deliveries. We also want our volunteers to not go inside the homes. Powell has the supplies and the staff. She hopes seniors or their caretakers will now reach out. So I think having something like this in place ready to go would definitely be able to benefit for future outbreaks.